A survey conducted by InfoTrack indicates that most government ministries are still not accessible to the Kenyan public. The survey commissioned by the International Commission of Jurists indicates that although access to information is a constitutional right, little effort is being made to allow free flow of information. Timothy Oteno with that report. Are government ministries in the country accessible to you as a Kenyan? That question was the basis upon which a survey was conducted by InfoTrack between the months of March and April this year. According to the findings, the Ministry of Environment and Natural Resources ranked highest on the overall access to public information by Kenyans. This followed by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and the Ministry of Agriculture. Perhaps due to the sensitive nature of information it handles, the Ministry of Defense ranked lowest when it comes to easy access to information by the public. And really what we're looking at is the, the ministry itself and whether the ministry is present and not so much the individuals uh, in their personal capacities uh, managing those ministries. The report was conducted on the pillars of responsiveness and availability of structures that allow for attainment of information by the public based on either telephone calls, physical visits or via the web. The level of information disclosure on the web ranked highly for the Ministry of Transport. On the flip side, the Ministry of East African Affairs and Tourism is the worst when it comes to online display of information. An interesting finding considering the ministry received 5.2 billion shillings during this year's budget to boost tourism. Yet, the ministry's online website lacks vital information that can assist online users know more about Kenya. InfoTrack director Angela Mbido, however, says information in some ministries may have not been forthcoming since some services have been devolved to the counties. Then there was email. And we sent out the seven uh, different scenarios uh, to, the, to all the ministries, both in Nairobi, the ones in Nyeri, and the ones in Mombasa. Guess how many responses we got back via email in the digital era? Zero. Not one response to email did we get. The survey polled over 1,400 respondents within Nairobi, Nyeri and Mombasa and included general questions common in all 18 ministries on matters of job applications, publications and tendering processes. According to Article 35 of the Kenyan Constitution, every citizen has a right to access information held by the state and by extension state organs. Now whether this information is provided first of all in a timely manner, secondly in the most appropriate format and thirdly whether this information is credible remains to be the discretion of the different agencies. Timothy Otieno, KTN, Nairobi.